Sherholtz has the best arm. Fairly shallow. More center than right. Cousins is going to test him. Posey can't handle it. And Posey gets clobbered. Posey is hurt. And he never caught the ball. The Marlins are back ahead. And the Giants' only focus now is Buster Posey. It looked like head to head con contact. Dave Greshner and assistant trainer Mark Bruce back out there with Bruce Bochi hovering. The fans chatting Posey. It might be his leg. Looked like he may have hyperextended the leg when he was knocked back. And he's up as far as sitting. As you can see, the left leg or ankle and getting a lot of help from Greshner and Griesbeck. Greshner into the right arm, the head Giants trainer. And that is a sobering sight for any Giants fan and for any baseball fan, one of the great young talents in the game. Eli Whiteside has put the gear on. He is going to come in as the catcher as they help Posey down the steps through the dugout. A lot more steps down there. There's a little auxiliary trainer's room close down the near the dugout in the tunnel. Ben Potenziano, another of the assistant trainers, is there as well. And this is. Having to neg navigate quite a few steps there. At the collision, and look at the left ankle get bent back, and you get a pretty good look at how he took the hit and how the left ankle got twisted back. And I mean, I, I'm hoping that it is the ankle and that it didn't go up into the knee. 